All right, ladies and gentlemen of D-Class personnel, sit down. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Commander And the SCP we're gonna be looking at today, 1624, object class Euclid. Special containment procedures. SCP-1624's IP address is to be blocked by all public service providers. Foundation assets and world governments are to prevent it from being accessed. Information recovered from SCP-1624 has been placed in Site-77's archives. Description, SCP-1624 is a website located at the IP address. The front page proclaims it as www.loveinside. Layout and design of the website appears to be designed for online romantic encounters between parasitic organisms and their host. Profiles on the website encountered so far include approximately different types of organisms. Entries for instances of SCP-940, SCP-1027, SCP-1429, SCP-2829, and SCP-3060 have been observed. Profiles belonging to the parasitic organisms hereafter referred to as 1624-1 typically list name, age and human in parasitic years, and what they want from their potential partner. There are options to contact the user, leave a comment on the profile, or to report the user for harassment. In addition, host organism profiles can be found with lists of attributes attractive to parasites. As of 11-16-2000, no method of creating a parasite type profile has been found. Subjects responding to an SCP-1624 profile will begin to display symptoms of carrying the specified Dash-1 instance, such as loss of appetite, loss of nutrition, being open to infection, and being more prone to infection. These symptoms will last indefinitely, despite there being no actual parasite present. The subjects may say that they are able to communicate with the instance, claiming that it is able to talk to them from their stomach. Depending on how the subject was exposed to SCP-1624, they will have different reactions. Subjects who willingly expose themselves to SCP-1624 will have a positive relationship with their instance. Subjects who are forced into it, such as D-Class personnel, will claim that the instance is emotionally abusive to them. As time progresses, the subject may begin to form a romantic relationship with the Dash 1 instance. Subjects will watch television, go on vacations, talk, and consume food based on the actions and conversations completed with their Dash 1 instance. When questioned, subjects will claim to be in a long-distance relationship. If the subject is infected by a real parasite, they will cease to be affected by SCP-1624. Subjects will claim to feel extreme remorse afterwards, claiming that they were unfaithful to the Dash 1 instance. Addendum, profile example. Name, Timmy J. Tapeworm. Age, 21 in parasitic years, 3.2 weeks in human years. Occupation, professional basketball player. Biography, I was taken in at a young age to the colon of redacted, but even with all that fame and attention, I wanted more. I struck out on my own to play professional basketball and made it. Now I'm looking for someone to share the rest of my life with. If you're interested, try and contact the office of Coach Redacted. I'm currently co-rooming in his colon. Seeking. A homo sapient male seeking a soulmate to fill a void inside them. 92% water, 98.8 degrees Fahrenheit, mean temperature, 100% faithful. Special note, vegetarians need not apply. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that was... SCP-1624, you are dismissed.